This is insane, this whole bag is filled with brand new Nike clothing. This might be my craziest for yet. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am starting off at Saks Fifth Avenue and I'm already seeing crazy stuff like what is this? There's a single Valentino shoe. But if you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and also leave me a comment and let me know what you think of this score. Really quick, I just wanted to let you guys know I'm launching my website so you can buy things online for me. A lot of what is in this video is already posted. If you subscribe to the mailing list, you can get 10% off, so check it out. Link is in the bio. So like I said, there's a single Valentino shoe. Hopefully I can find the other one. Some Tory Burch shoes, they're still in the box. Michael Kors flip-flops, and then there's some slippers, and I saw a bunch more down there, but this bag is leaking and it's getting everything dirty. More slippers, and then a pair of these footy socks. Everything is still new. Okay, so I found another Valentino shoe. This is a slide, but there's only one. Hopefully I can find the other one. For some reason, these are super dirty, but they still have tags on them. Another pair of Tory Burch shoes. And then I don't know who these are from, but these are new in the box as well. And then back there, I don't know if you can see it, but all of the shoe boxes are full. Okay, I just opened the other side of the dumpster and look at all of this. There's so many shoes and I found the matching pair to the Valentino shoe. There's a bunch of Calvin Klein clothing in here. All of this here is Calvin Klein. They're all on the hanger still. Okay, it's the next day. I took everything with me. So this is what I can salvage from Saks Fifth Avenue. Look at all of that clothing. Unfortunately, there's so much more of this, but there's a bunch of trash bags and they all leaked and got everything dirty. So I had to leave a lot of it behind. Okay, starting out with the shoes, all of it is name brand. There's Tory Burch shoes, Michael Kors, Tommy Hilfiger. I think the craziest are these Valentino shoes. They were like 500 on sale for 200, but I just can't believe that they threw all of this away. And they all have matching pairs. There's a ton of slippers. Unfortunately, I couldn't find the matching pairs. These were so cute though, um, but slippers everything new still with tags and same thing with all of this clothing it's all name brand still with tags really cute too i think all of these shirts are those calvin klein shirts that i found a ton of different colors and then some sweaters really cute too some different styles here and then there's some plaid shirts underneath and then there's some dresses over here these are so cute, a couple of sweaters, all of this new tags, name brand Betsy Johnson, <laughs> so cute, but yeah, I can't believe I found all of this, I have no idea why they threw all this stuff away. Hey guys, I'm dumpster diving at Nike again, and there's a huge bag, and it looks like it's full of Nike stuff, right on top I see socks, but there's a bunch of clothing in here. I'm so excited to go through. It looks like a lot of things still have tags on. So I ended up just taking the bag with me. I didn't want to risk getting caught, but this bag is filled. All of this is Nike and it looks like everything still has tags on it. Okay, the first thing I just pulled out are three of these men's jackets. Look at that price. Um, so there's different sizes of these. There's a pink hoodie and really cute might fit me all right i was digging and i just found another one of those men's jackets so now there's four of these a pair of men's pants they're a really weird fabric but they're pretty nice here's a couple of sports bras that one is really cute and then just a black one a couple of hoodies this one has like a gold has like gold accents and then a blue one. It's starting to get dark, but I'm almost finished. A couple of long sleeves, that one. And then there's that one too. Okay, the last thing from Nike is this men's jacket and then a couple pairs of socks. I'm at Ulta and I found a bag, a suit bag, and it was in a black bag, but I can tell that this is in here. And then there's also some, it looks like makeup and skincare that they didn't destroy, they just souped it up. 
but I'm gonna see what I can grab. You can tell these are all full. Just the outsides of them are all dirty. So I'm gonna see what's in here and clean it up. Okay, as I'm digging, I found a pair of Juicy Couture sunglasses. I guess that maybe like a customer left them and they just threw them away. Okay, I just cleaned everything up and this is what I found from Ulta. So a lot of this is still in the box and then there's some skincare items. This is all of the skincare and I think some hair care in here as well that I found. The first heat tool I found is a straightener curling iron. It's in the box still and they didn't cut the cord so it works. I did test it. Next is a Baby Blizz curling iron. They did cut the cord on it but it can easily be fixed so I still took it with me. And the last thing I found are two of these manicure sets. They're still in the original packaging and taped shut but I'm going to open it so you guys can see. As you can see, it still has all of the pieces in here and I did test it and it does turn on. And that is so cute. You can actually dry your fingernails right there. Oh my gosh, this is insane. This is my Kirkland's dumpster and it goes all the way back there, but this is all like Christmas and Halloween and fall. It's like a mix of everything, but there's so much in here. Like a bunch of these. Well, I see a lot of these little sign things. And then see a bunch of these fall collection. Oh, that's so cute. Let's see. Huge pile of them here. And then these look like Thanksgiving mats. And these are really nice too. Home sweet, thankful home. There are a bunch of different signs in here. Hello pumpkin. Little mini ones as well. These ones were definitely from Thanksgiving some christmas ones these are so cute i don't know why all of this couldn't be donated it's insane how far back all of this goes i think all of that down there are these christmas ornaments and then there's also a bunch of these trees so i'm just gonna start grabbing things out grabbing as much as i can christmas banners there's just so much in here it's insane i just found this big bag and i think these are ornaments they have little strings attached but just a huge bag of these winter christmas ornaments in here it looks like they discounted everything but they still threw it away i guess this is what didn't sell the more i dig the more ornaments I find. There's just a ton of different kinds in here. There's just so many. And the thing is, this is a crusher, so there's a bunch of stuff all the way back there that already got crushed, but all of this is up here, so I can still grab it. I just have to be careful. So I peeked inside my Bath and Body Works and look at all of these candles in here. This is crazy. They just threw them right on top, and it looks like a lot of them are not even broken. Like all of these ones are new. It looks like maybe holiday scents and they just threw them away. But yeah, they're a little bit dirty on the outside, but not burnt or broken. Look at that. There's a couple of bags here. This bag has a burnt candle. It's not broken. Let's see, that one is white tea and sage. And then there's a mini candle that is broken. This bag has some, it looks like wallflowers. There's a couple of wallflowers. This one is so pretty. It is burnt, so I think they usually always work, but I'm going to clean them up. And then a burnt candle. Just ripped open a couple more bags from Bath & Body Works, and it doesn't look like they destroyed anything tonight. A couple of body washes, and then a lotion right here. There's also a couple of candles, and it doesn't look like they're broken, and they're brand new. And then there's two more in this bag. Both of these two are not broken. Here's all the candles I found from last night. So all of these are not burnt or broken. Okay, I just popped the tops off so you guys can see. They're all brand new, and they smell amazing, so I'm so glad that I stopped here. I almost missed it. Okay, I'm at my anthropology, and there's a few things in here. This caught my eye. It's like a towel bar. Looks like a few pieces might have broke off, but that is really cute. And then there's this thing, which looks like a candle, and it doesn't look like it's broken, maybe chipped. And here's the lid to the candle. It makes like a little cottage house. And then there's also 
a broken mug, broken candle, and I think there's another broken candle. Yeah, and then another broken candle.